watch the entire video and apply the provided steps to elevate your confidence to its peak. Welcome to LuxoLife, your partner in life. In today's video, discover how to supercharge your confidence. We understand the challenges and that's why this video is here for you. Let's get started without delay. Your confidence journey begins now. Our first step is about cultivating new skills. Think of yourself as a gardener, tending to the garden of your mind and abilities. Just like a garden needs diverse plants to flourish, you need a variety of skills to thrive in the ever-changing landscape of life. So, grab your metaphorical gardening tools and get ready to plant the seeds of knowledge. Imagine each new skill as a vibrant bloom, adding color and depth to the canvas of your capabilities. Whether it's learning a new language, mastering a musical instrument, or diving into the world of coding, each skill you acquire is like a petal contributing to the uniqueness of your personal bouquet. Stepping out of your comfort zone is the best way to unearth the diamonds of personal growth. It's like embarking on a thrilling adventure where the unknown becomes your playground. Imagine discomfort as the sculptor's chisel molding and shaping you into a more resilient and adaptable version of yourself. Embracing discomfort is not about seeking pain, it's about understanding that the magic happens just beyond the boundaries of what you already know. Picture a butterfly emerging from its cocoon. There's a moment of struggle, but that struggle is what gives the wings strength. Similarly, when you embrace discomfort, you're allowing yourself to undergo a transformative process. It's about realizing that the cocoon of familiarity can be cozy, but the wings of your potential are waiting to unfold. So, be bold in the face of uncertainty, for in discomfort, you find the raw materials for building a bolder, more courageous you. Self-care is the gentle art of tending to your own well-being, a necessary act of kindness that you owe to yourself. Imagine your body and mind as a well-worn machine it requires regular maintenance to keep running smoothly. Prioritizing self-care is like giving your internal engine the oil it needs to purr contentedly. It's not selfish, it's survival. Consider self-care as the oxygen mask you put on before assisting others. It's not about neglecting responsibilities, it's about ensuring that you have the strength to fulfill them. Just like a gardener tends to a garden, Nurture your mind with moments of peace, feed your body with nourishing food, and water your soul with activities that bring you joy. Improving your posture can be a transformative journey like sculpting the physical embodiment of confidence. Imagine your spine as the sturdy mast of a ship and your posture as the sails that catch the winds of self-assurance. It's not just about standing up straight, it's about asserting your presence in the world. Consider your body as the canvas and good posture as the brush strokes that paint a picture of strength and poise. When you stand tall, you're not just aligning your bones, you're aligning your mindset with one of resilience and self-assuredness. It's a simple yet powerful act that communicates to the world and yourself that you are ready to face whatever comes your way. So, throw back your shoulders, lift your chin, and let every step be a testament to your inner strength. It's okay to seize fleeting moments with a gusto of a child chasing bubbles in the wind. Imagine time as a river and moments as the sparkling pebbles you can hold in your hands. Life is a collection of these precious moments, and when you seize them, you're not just existing, you're dancing with a rhythm of existence. Know that it's not about the quantity of time, but the quality of the moments you collect. Seizing fleeting moments is like capturing fireflies in a jar. It's about savoring the brilliance of now. Be it a spontaneous laugh, a warm hug, or a quiet sunset, you have the power to turn these ephemeral moments into lasting memories. 
Limiting social media is like taking the reins of your time and attention, steering them away from the constant buzz of virtual chatter. Imagine your day as a book and social media as just one chapter, important but not the entire story. It's not about abandoning the digital realm, it's about reclaiming the hours that could be spent on more enriching activities. By setting boundaries, you're creating space for real-life connections, personal growth, and moments of quiet reflection. It's about acknowledging that your time is valuable and that the curated snippets of others' lives shouldn't overshadow the narrative of your own. Speaking kindly to yourself is also planting seeds of encouragement in the garden of your mind. Imagine your inner dialogue as a gentle breeze that nurtures the fragile buds of self-esteem. It's not about ignoring flaws or shortcomings, it's about addressing them with the warmth and compassion you would offer a friend. Your mind is a sanctuary and the words you choose as the hymns that resonate within its walls. When you speak kindly to yourself, you're not just fostering a positive mindset, you're cultivating an environment where growth and self-love can flourish. It's about rewriting the narrative that plays in your head, transforming criticism into constructive encouragement. Stepping onto a stage where you are both the actor and the audience also means entering spaces confidently. Picture every room, every meeting, every gathering as a stage waiting for your presence to illuminate it. It's not about arrogance or seeking attention, it's about acknowledging your worth and bringing your unique energy to the space. So let's approach each entrance with the certainty that you have something valuable to contribute. Consider confidence as the key that unlocks doors and paves the way for meaningful connections. When you enter a space confidently, you're not just making a physical presence, you're making a statement about your self-assurance and readiness to engage. It's about recognizing that you are an important player in the scenes of your life and your energy can influence the atmosphere around you. You matter. Let those words echo in the corridors of your mind like a powerful anthem. Letting your worth speak is a reminder that your existence is not a whisper, but a resounding declaration in the grand symphony of life. Imagine your worth as a steady heartbeat, a rhythm that adds cadence to your journey. It's not about proving your value to others, it's about embracing the inherent worthiness that resides within you. Take every accomplishment, every setback, and every moment of quiet strength as notes in the melody of your worth. When you let worth speak, you're not seeking validation. You're allowing your actions, your resilience, and your authenticity to be the eloquent storytellers of your value. It's about recognizing that you bring something unique to the table, and your worth is not contingent on external applause, but on the steadfast belief in your own capabilities. Listening genuinely is like opening the door to understanding in the mansion of communication. It's not just about hearing words, it's about immersing yourself in the emotions, thoughts, and nuances expressed by others. Genuine listening is the bridge that connects hearts and minds. When you truly listen, you're not waiting for your turn to speak. You're creating the space for empathy to flourish. It's about recognizing the value of every voice, understanding diverse perspectives, and building connections that go beyond the surface. So clear the clutter of your mind, be present in the moment, and let every word shared with you be a brushstroke in the masterpiece of mutual understanding. Look so lovers, you've just been equipped with all the steps to boost your confidence to its finest. We're confident you found this video helpful, so go ahead, give it a thumbs up, drop your thoughts in the comments, and share the wisdom with others. If you're new around here, confidently hit that subscribe button and smash the notification bell. We want you to confidently stay in the loop for our latest videos. See you in the next video, Luxo lovers. Again, this is Luxo Life, your partner in life and we're thrilled to be on this confidence-boosting journey with you.